One of the most common questions I get about Scrum is whether or not Scrum is only applicable for software delivery teams, and that's not really true. I've seen Scrum Framework be applied in many industries, um, academia, marketing, media, financial services, and it's really not just software development teams. Basically, if you work in any organisation or industry that deals with complex environments, so customers where their requirements or their demands are constantly changing, the Scrum framework really lets you experiment and deliver value quickly to your customer. I really like to say, instead of trying to focus on your teams being more efficient, try to make them more effective. The way I think, like to think about it is we can be really good at doing bad stuff if our only measure of progress is output. So I say focus on outcomes, so that's my first tip. When you're looking to improve your processes and you're looking to improve efficiency as well, then look at things like lead time or cycle time and identify where waste is in your process. Also, very importantly, give your team the ability to invest time in removing that waste. It is as important to make your processes more efficient as it is to make your product more qualitative and valuable. I always like to not talk about work when I'm working with a team first, so definitely get to know your team at a human level. Um, you will be likely working with these people for a long period of time and it is important to have great interpersonal relationships. Allow the team to self-organise. They are most capable of understanding where they will be able to add value. Give them the boundaries like what that team needs to achieve or deliver or build and let them decide how they will organise around that work. Scrum is a very simple framework, but it is incredibly difficult to master. And the reason I say that is because it's just guidelines, um, it can be really hard to grapple with how it is applicable to your team or your organisation. So one of the key takeaways for doing this two-day course will be not just to be able to do the assessment and understand Scrum by the book, but how you can apply it in your workplace. So if you have questions around what does a product owner mean for you, what does a scrum master really do, how does a product backlog really work, how is that different to a sprint backlog, all of these questions and many will be answered over the two days. It will be very interactive, it will be full of real life case studies and you will be able to come back with real life steps to apply the framework in your workplace.